Are you curious to know how this sea turtle puzzle fares in my review? I got it as a gift, so we're both gonna find out together. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I have a beautiful 500 piece sea turtle puzzle to do with you guys today. This puzzle was actually a gift someone brought back from their tropical vacation. So I've never actually done this puzzle nor any puzzles from pineapple puzzles before. Fun for the whole Ohana. So I'm really curious to know if I'm gonna like it or if this is kind of like a low quality gift shop puzzle. Stick around, I'm gonna be doing a time lapse and then a review of this puzzle at the end. We'll figure out if it was all smooth sailing or choppy waters. I'll see you after this time lapse. And there you have it, the completion of this tropical sea turtle and fish puzzle. I'm happy to say I really enjoyed putting this one together. I was initially pretty nervous about the abundance of blue in this puzzle, especially considering the last one I just finished. Check it out here if you really wanna see me suffer. But um, the background colors and the shapes of the pieces ended up being varied enough that it really wasn't too hard to figure out which blue went where. Another thing that made this puzzle surprisingly easy was being able to identify key characters in the poster right here. Just like the sea urchin and a couple tropical fish, um, I could pick up the piece and know exactly where they went. So that gave me anchor points to work from and it made the whole assembly a lot smoother. In fact, I did most of this puzzle in one sitting, which is super rare for me. Yes! As for the quality of this puzzle, it was spot on. You never really know what you're gonna get with gift shop puzzles. Um, so I was a little concerned about maybe like the picture flaking off or false fits, but really everything fit together really nice. And when I knew I had a piece, I knew I had it. Other than kind of some trouble over here with this border, but we got that worked out. Not only was this a super delightful puzzle solving experience, but it super put me in the mood for summer. If you're someone who likes underwater, colorful, landscape fishy scenes, I would highly recommend this puzzle. I have put it, a link to it in the description so you can try it too. Thank you all for joining me on my puzzle journey today. If you enjoyed this video and wanna see more puzzling content, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Also, please drop a line in the comments to let me know what kind of puzzles you wanna see me work on next. Until next time, happy puzzling, and I'll see you at my next video.